To get a good deal on your new home, you should know about most purchase agreements are contingent on which two items and how they work. What is a contingency? A contingency is a provision in a contract that suspends the obligation of one or more parties to perform their obligations until the occurrence of some uncertain event. In real estate, contingencies are often used to protect buyers from purchasing a property they later discover is not what they want. Typically purchase agreements are contingent on inspection contingency and financing contingency. The inspection contingency clause in a purchase agreement requires the buyer to inspect the property before signing the contract. The financing contingency requires the buyer to have financing before signing the contract. It also permits the buyer to postpone the closing until they have found financing for their purchase. Understanding the inspection contingency. An inspection contingency clause in a purchase agreement allows the buyer to cancel the transaction before closing if the property fails to meet specific criteria, such as not being up to code or not meeting their needs. A property buyer may ask for an inspection period before signing on the dotted line and agreeing to purchase it. This gives them time to investigate whether or not they want to buy the property without worrying about being obligated to do so. Understanding the inspection contingency. Photo credit, Canva. The seller may then agree to this request, but with some stipulations, such as requiring money up front or getting paid back if they cannot sell the home. It can either be an option or a condition. An option gives the buyer the right to cancel without reason, while a state requires them to provide a reason for canceling. Financial contingency. Financial contingencies are most common in real estate and are usually put in place when the buyer is uncertain whether he will be able to get financing for the property. Its purpose is to protect both parties against unforeseen circumstances and provide some protection for buyers who may not be able to close on their purchase due to unexpected events such as job loss or medical emergencies. Financial contingency states that if the buyer defaults on the contract, the seller is entitled to payment of the contracted price. The contingency may be based on the following. 1. The seller's credit rating can be checked through a credit report. 2. A specific value for the property can then be determined by an appraisal or other means. 3. A percentage of the purchase price can then be determined by an appraisal or other means. 4. A specific date, such as 6 months after closing. Contingencies are not roadblocks. A contingency is an agreement contingent on a future event, so they should not be seen as roadblocks. They protect either party in a real estate contract from adverse consequences. The two main contingencies in a real estate contract are inspection contingency and financial contingency. The inspection contingency allows the buyer to back out of a contract or renegotiate the terms if they find something wrong with the property. Whereas financial contingencies usually include a clause that requires the buyer to have enough funds to pay for the property before they can take possession of it.